Welcome and thank you for joining us at our Daily Bread Ministries for this evening's meditative podcast. Tonight, we're reflecting on the love of Jesus displayed on the cross. God has given you this moment to slow down and be still before him. Close your eyes and let your head gently sink into your pillow. Breathe deeply, easing out the tension of your body with every exhale. Invite God's presence to fill you as you breathe in. This place of peaceful rest is God's gift to all his children. It is time to hand the day's joys and burdens to him and to open your heart to the refreshing hope and reassurance of his word. Heavenly Father, as your child, I humbly yet confidently come before you. Thank you that I can rest under the shelter of your wings here in the secret place of your presence. Mark 14, 22 to 24 says, While they were eating, Jesus took bread, and when he had given thanks, he broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take it, this is my body. Then he took a cup, and when he had given thanks, he gave it to them, and they all drank from it. This is my blood of the covenant, which is poured out for many, he said to them. Jesus used symbolic items to explain his death on the cross. He passed pieces of bread to his disciples, saying, Take it, this is my body. Then they all drank from one cup of wine, of which he said, This is my blood of the covenant, which is poured out for many. The Lord Jesus gave his body and his blood for us, for you. Take it, he says to us again tonight. By his sacrifice, you are redeemed and restored. You are rightfully his once more. What love Jesus showed, and what a cost he was prepared to pay. Our hearts cannot fathom the depth of such a gift. So we come in awe and humility tonight to say, Thank you, O precious Jesus, for your boundless love for me. Jesus went to the cross for you. He invites you into the freedom that comes from knowing that there is nothing now that separates you from him. As we turn to prayer, breathe deeply, working out any tension through long, slow exhales. The presence of the Lord is a place of rest and peace. Do this breathing exercise to relax your body, refocus your heart, and become aware of the presence of our Almighty God, who promises to hear every word on our lips and in our hearts. Breathe in. And out. And in. And out. And in. And in. 
hand out. Let's pray. Dear Jesus, I marvel that you would give your blood and body for me. What love, what cost, all to make me your own. Thank you for all you have done. Lord God, once again I gratefully receive this precious salvation. You have redeemed me for all eternity, not with gold or silver, but with the blood of the Lamb. Ephesians 1, 7-9 says, In him we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins, in accordance with the riches of God's grace that he lavished on us. With all wisdom and understanding, he made known to us the mystery of his will, according to his good pleasure, which he purposed in Christ. Let's close with a final prayer. Heavenly Father, my sin was great, but your grace was greater still. Thank you for sending your Son to pour out his life for me. I look at the cross and see the Lord who would do anything for his people, who would go as far as it takes to save them who will never stop fighting for them, or for me. I praise the wonderful name of Jesus. Amen.